G'day, g'day, D5 family, Bruce here with another video. Welcome to my channel where I document my D5 life. If you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that like button and hit that notification button so you can get updates on when I bring out new videos. Today we're talking about the Drip Network strategy, the 12-month strategy calculator that I created uh, a few weeks ago. I've updated that calculator to version 3. So... We're going to have a bit of a dive down into my strategy calculator for Drip Ecosystem. That includes the Animal Farm, Drip Faucet, and the Drip Garden. So if you're invested in all three of those uh, protocols on the Drip Ecosystem, then you're in luck. We've got a calculator just for you. So you ready? Let's have a look at the updates for Drip Calculator version 3. Okay, change of clothes, change of time. Bit of a Stuff up there on my part. Anyway, it's all good. Got my coffee. Some things are worth doing twice. So here we go. Take two. <laughs> and here we go with the Drip Simulator version 3. Uh, and the updates from version 2. Now, if you are not in the Drip ecosystem and you are just getting in now and you haven't seen version 2, that's okay. You can go straight into version 3 without worrying about that. So version three here, we have the title, Drip Ecosystem 12 Month Strategy, version three, my Twitter handle. So if you want to get in touch with me, uh, a bit of details about the calculator and a link to my various referral links and uh, YouTube links and whatnot on a link tree. So that's there. We have the Drip Live Price and the Animal Farm Pigs Live Price coming through. Look at this, Animal Farm Pigs has had a bit of a pump this morning. So that's pretty good. That was $65 yesterday. And drip is now $781, below $8. So good time to DCA into drip, I reckon. So that's pretty cool. Animal Farm Pigs had a 12% pump overnight, despite the market continuing to go down. So isn't that fantastic? So this table at the very top is an overview of your uh, investments. So I'm not going to touch on this just yet because this is really just taking all the detail from the calculator and putting it into one uh, set of uh, cells for you to read and, and gather information from. Then we have the results as well, the 12 months. Uh, after 12 months, you have your uh, total investment that you've paid, that you've paid in, daily passive income, and your total unrealized gains, and your total realized gains. So we'll come back to that in a minute. I'm just going to go and break down the three the three protocols in this calculator are the drip garden, the drip faucet, and the piggy bank. So each protocol is laid out very, very much the same. There's just a couple of slight differences between each one of them, and we'll go through those in a second. The first one is drip garden. The drip garden here, we have the initial investment. So this is where you put in uh, your initial investment. Now, I will say again, the yellow sections on this calculator are the sections that you can update, that you can edit. Anything outside of the yellow sections, just don't touch. So the initial investment is $600, and the plant count is 22,000. So whatever your plant count is, put that in there. So let's have a quick look at my plant count. Currently, my plant count is 22,417. 85 new plants, I'll plant those later. So 22,417. So whatever your plant count is, you just put it in here, 2,417. Now we have the weekly claiming strategy. So we have a weekly claiming strategy. The best strategy, in my personal opinion, is claiming one day a week and compounding six days a week across all three uh, protocols. That's my personal opinion. Now this calculator is designed for you to test whatever strategy is best for you. You can claim one day a week. You can claim two days a week. You can claim three days a week. It's totally up to you. I recommend claiming no more than three days a week. If you do more than three days a week, then you're going to just uh, drain the protocol and we all lose. So <laughs> much better to claim one day, two days, or three days a week and compound for the rest of the week. For the drip garden, I have what's called a rollover to drip and piggy bank. So what this means is if I select this checkbox, the realized gains from the drip garden 
uh, no longer realized. What that, what that does is it takes the profits that I would normally take from the drip garden and then deposits them back into the drip, the drip faucet and the piggy bank. So we have drip BUSD as the LP. So we just split half of that, which is drip, and the other half, which is BUSD, and we split them up into the drip faucet and to the piggy bank. And we apply the appropriate taxes for, for transfers and purchasing and whatnot. So it's all calculated in the background. And uh, when you check that tick box, that's what happens there. The, the realized gains are no longer there anymore. They go straight into the drip faucet and straight into the piggy bank. So that if that is a strategy that you wish to do, you can do that. If it's not something you want to do, you can uncheck that box and withdraw your realized gains. Now, for those who don't understand what unrealized and realized gains are, realized gains are what you've withdrawn from the protocol and converted over to a stable coin or withdrawn to a exchange or wherever. So you've actually withdrawn and converted the tokens back into dollars, like USD, BUSD, that kind of thing. Unrealized gains is what you've compounded back into the protocol, and that accumulates and allows you to have a bigger bag and obviously a bigger uh, profit, daily profit, as the bag grows. So I'm going to need a coffee. Oh, that's good. Moving on. In the drip garden uh, table, we have the plant count. So at the end of every month, it shows what your plant count will be. So that's a nice new feature added on from version 2 to version 3. So it shows your plant count. Another nice feature is reinvesting money. So if you want to add more to the protocol, you can do that. This first month is taken from the initial investment up the top. So the initial investment you put in is actually put in here. So you cannot edit the first investment, but you can edit up the top here as your initial investment. If you want to add further funds to the protocol, you can do that. Just add whatever you want. You might want to take 10% of your wage and put it into the protocol. So that might be $50, $100, $200, whatever it is. You can calculate a potential return on your investment as you keep dollar cost averaging back into the protocol. So that's nice to have. And that is pretty much the drip garden section. Down the bottom, you have your, your finished plant count, which is 949 million plants per day, 31 million, and your passive daily income or daily passive income, 1.5 thousand, 1,500. So that will obviously update as you test your strategies out. So by all means, put in, put in whatever you feel you can uh, afford to invest and see how that looks in the long term, 12 months. So moving on to Drip Faucet, very much similar. We have the initial investment, uh, put in whatever you've invested in the first place. And then you want to put in your current uh, drip count. So let's have a look at my drip, my drip count currently is 86.5 so i'm just going to leave that at 86 for now oh and the one thing i forgot to mention was the the price adjustments so across the drip garden across the drip faucet and across the piggy bank we have these 12 cells and these are months so month one through to 12 so what we want to do is we want to estimate what the price will be for each token across 12 months. So again, this is another way of, of tracking your investment in a bear market or in a bull market. So you can actually apply whatever price you want to the token every month. And that will calculate, calculate the price across your investment for the following months as well. So yeah, I forgot to mention that before, but uh, yeah, these are the prices that you can adjust as you go. So month to month. Do whatever price you feel you're comfortable in believing that the token will be at. I've gone really, really conservative for Drip and the Drip Garden and Piggy Bank because I don't want to raise my expectations too high and get disappointed in the long run. So, so yeah, moving on with that, we have the three claim, a three-day claim strategy. So I've, I've selected one day per week for that claiming strategy, which is my preferred strategy. And for the adding on investments every month, I've added $100 per month. So if you don't want to add any more money, that's fine. Just put, it, put these at zero. It's totally up to you. 
So again, we have the, at the bottom, the finished drip count, 2000 drip, which is 20 drip per day and a, a passive, a daily passive income of $142. Okay. Moving on to the piggy bank. Piggy bank is very, very much the same. Just some slight differences because we have locked stakes to look at. So unfortunately for this particular calculator, we can only do one locked stake. Uh, for people who have multiple locked stakes, I apologize. It's probably a little bit too complex for me to uh, add in the calculator doing multiple stakes at this, at this time anyway. So we have your initial investment like the previous, uh, previous ones. And in Piglet's, Piglet's account. So if we have a look at the Piglet's price, because the Piglet's price is up is gone up a little bit because of the price of pigs has gone up 12%. So it's now 0.3 of a cent. Last night it was 0.2 something of a cent. Now it's 0.3. So let's just go over and change that. Not much of a change, but again, with the price prediction, I've done conservative predictions over the next 12 months. So below the, so below the strategy for selecting your comp, your claiming strategy, is the amount of weeks that you can pick for staking. So I've only made it up to one year and a handful of, of time frames: four weeks, eight weeks, 12 weeks, 26 and 52. So whatever staking strategy, strategy that you have, you can select. If I select four weeks, the first month you cannot claim. So it's locked. Same for 12 weeks. So 12 weeks is locked, but the last, Maybe the last week of the third month, it's uh, there's one day open there for claiming. So whatever whatever strategy you pick, the protocol will, will lock that or the calculator will lock that and you won't be able to claim. So my initial uh, investment was locked for four weeks, which shows here. Whatever uh, lock you have, choose whatever the, you want, whatever it's four weeks, eight weeks. 52 weeks, uh, it's totally up to you. Again, we have the piglet count at the end of every month, the unrealized gains and the realized gains. And as well, the addition of being able to reinvest money every month. So whatever you feel comfortable with to reinvest, you can add it there. At the bottom, we have the finished piglet count, 6 billion piglets. At the end of 12 months, 213 piglets every day and a daily passive income of $1,200. That is a detailed look at each protocol and how you can uh, work your strategy and add your investment here and do different methods. You know, do two days a week, three days a week, whatever, you, whatever you're comfortable with. You can roll over your drip garden into the drip faucet or the piggy bank. Have a play with that. The link is in the description below. Coming back to the top, we have the overview. After you've done entering all your information into the calculator below, it'll show you the overview here. So your initial investment is $2,200 and then your additional investments every month is also calculated here, which will then show as a total investment of $5,650. Your daily passive income, it shows every month. So at the end of every month, it'll show you how much you'll be earning every day if you wish to withdraw uh, from the protocol every day. And that's calculated here. So at the end of 12 months, I'll be earning $3,000 a day. That would be pretty good, I think. We also have accumulation of your plants, drip and piglets. So at the end of every month, it shows the count for all three of those protocols. Fairly simple. Then we have unrealized gains, which calculates what's left in the protocol, earning interest for you to withdraw every day. Total of $225,000 of unrealized gains uh, at the end of 12 months. And the same for realized gains. It shows what you've withdrawn every month for 12 months and a total of $36,000 withdrawn. Not bad at all, I think. All right, guys, that's my simple overview of the drip calculator. Drip Ecosystem 12 Month Strategy version 3. Feel free to click the link in the description and when you do, click on File, make a copy. And that will make your own copy of this calculator where you can edit everything. You don't need to ask for permissions from me. You can make your own copy and feel free to, to do whatever you want 
add the numbers you want and see how your strategy goes. All right, DeFi family, if you like my content, don't forget to subscribe, like this video and hit that notification button. Also, the link to these protocols are in the description for, with my referral links. If you wish to get on board the protocols with me, I do three airdrops a month, uh, giving away quite a bit of my bags. So feel free to join in. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Love you. Talk to you soon. Cheers. Bye. You're still here? It's over. Go home. Go.